Balsamic Camp. They call it Bald's Memories. However, ritual abuse is real. Mind control is real. 50 survivors have now united their voices for the biggest disclosure of the secret global cult and the history of mankind. Everything will come to light. They explain how they became victims of ritual abuse and mind control. So I was, I was born into a cult family. So my father is a Freemason, Satanist, Rosicrucian, and he was also an ASIO operative. So ASIO in my country of Australia is the equivalent of the MI6 or um, CIA. Um, ich wurde von meinem eigenen Vater an diese Kreise verkauft. Er war zudem selbst auch pädokriminell. My father was a pedophile. Uh, ja, ganz klar, meine Familie. Meine Großmutter war eine mit von den Haupt meine Kulteltern waren Satanisten, so auch meine Großeltern. My family has on both sides political connections. They describe the horrors they had to endure. Ritual abuse, um, sex trafficking, torture and experiments. Of course they were wearing those uh, the robes with the, the black with caps over it, they are chanting, and a lot of candles. Total verängstigte Kinder in Holzverschlägen, in Käfigen, in Art Kellern eingesperrt. Manche der Kinder sind völlig apathisch, andere weinen und schreien ganz verzweifelt, andere wimmern vor sich hin. Mit Gewalt, also Vergewaltigungen, es hat wie so ein Ritual gegeben, also wo mit Tierblut. They were, um burning a child my age at a stake. Werkzeug zu sein, um einem kleinen Mädchen das Leben nehmen zu müssen, um und es dann am Ende auch noch essen zu there müssen. There were parties and they would eat babies and cook them and eat them like they were nothing. I have seen wealthy aristocratic white women ordering children of color on menus to be delivered, dead, cooked on platters in a wing of the place they called a cannibal's kitchen. Unfortunately, a child was killed, my friend. They continued to stab him, and then they told me I was given a knife, and I was told, oh, I have to help, kill. Boy. They testify about sophisticated mind control techniques. Uh, so it was trauma-based mind control, which involves um, a variety of sexual abuse, rape, sodomy. I had uh, cattle prods used on me, um, electric shock, drugs, hypnosis. Um, I was obviously linked up to machinery in, in some of the bases. Was sie eben auch machen. Das ist, dass durch diese wiederholte Folter und auch Missbrauch ja dann so verschiedene Persönlichkeitsanteile entstehen. Elektroschocks on my head. They were uh, organized. They were, they were wearing those white clothes. They, they were uh, used, I can have the flashbacks of the, the machines. They know what they were doing. Um, there was no experimentation done on me at all. Um, they knew exactly what was going to happen. A persona that was being created. And despite all these horrors, they have not lost their will to fight and to bring about change. And the fact of the matter is that it's everywhere and it's happening mostly in the elite circles. We're bringing together all the voices of the people that have been experiencing this. Uh, so I'm hopeful that we are affecting change. It's real. This is not 
fake and that's really hurtful to a survivor that nobody can believe on what happened to them in their past. Es findet tatsächlich statt und es ist irgendwie ganz, ganz wichtig, dass man die Leute, die das erfahren haben, nicht damit alleine lässt, weil ganz ehrlich, man unterstützt die Täter nur und man sorgt dafür, dass es weitergeht und das muss endlich aufhören. See now their full testimonies on 50voices.org with new survivors videos each Wednesday and Sunday.